So we continue with Shmona Prakim. And last time we finished chapter number three. Um, and we started chapter number four. In chapter number four, the topic was let me uh, healing the spiritual ill. Right? So and uh, we said that people who spiritually sick, whatever is bad for whatever Hashem said is bad, is discussing, they actually take uh, take very pride. Uh, be big pride in doing that, right? Like today, it's very, very popular. Okay, uh, it's actually been uh, all the times. Like, but uh, but today, people lost. The many people just simply lost shame. Okay, so let's see what are we talking about. Um, so part uh, part of it we, we actually discussed. So I, I'm going to just read it and see if we can add something and uh, continue with new material. So let's see what we said last time. Good conduct. Is a conduct that is balanced between two extremes, uh, such uh, extremes, each of which is unfavorable. So extremes never good. Extremes never good. Okay. Uh, one uh, in excess and one is restriction. So too much in one side or to, to another side is not good. A personal virtue refers to tendencies, <clears throat> and uh, to, tendency, uh, to tendencies and habits. That are equally balanced between bad uh, bad tendencies of excess and restriction. For um, from one's character traits come one conduct, right? So why why a person uh, behaves uh, this or that way? Because it's a character trait, right? Like because it, and these character traits, it's like uh, somebody does something by default, like automatic. Why? Because it became his habit. That's that's what it is. That habit came from. Character traits. For example, <clears throat> restraint is an inter restraint is an intermediate quality between indulgence and lack of any feeling of desire. So I, I, we discussed it last time. In, uh, indulgence not good. Like, uh, uh, lack of feeling of any desire also not good. It's not healthy. Thus, restraint uh, is a positive activity, meaning that, that you you can do whatever physical activity you, you, you're doing, but you can restrain yourself. So I'm, I'm going to do, but I'm only under the certain point. These character traits uh, that leads uh, to, to restraint is a positive character trait. So restraint, positive character traits, and uh, I don't remember we said last time or not, uh, in uh, Hilchos Dios, in our class, um, it's actually online. Um, when Rambam is, is talking about medicine and uh, healthy diet and other like uh, other advices, so he said uh, that even a lot of healthy food is not good. So it's it's all have to be in measure. Okay. Can, oh, right, and and some and some and uh, a little of poison, uh, some like not, not healthy food is there is no problem. If if it's only a little, right, then only from time to time there is no problem. So we, we don't have to like say up uh, like to, to some food. I don't know, like uh, some over salty food or something. There is no problem from time to time. Continue. Glutonous desire, by contrast, is one extreme. And the lack of desire is another extreme, both of which are utterly undesirable. Okay, um, they stem from the character trait, like uh, a trait of excess and restriction, so which is not good, uh, respectively, and uh, present and um, represent two of the inferior qualities. Okay, inferior meaning uh, the com. Complete, uh, complete exam. I'm not going to eat whatever food, or I'm going to eat as much as I can. None of them is good. Okay, so that's uh, how far we uh, went last time. So new material. So we're going to read the paragraph and explain. Similarly, gen generosity is a minute between uh, stinginess and uh, uh, profligacy. 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 Sorry. Um, Assurance is a median between uh, rashness and uh, ti timidity. Timidity, sorry, timidity. Good naturedness is a median between aggressiveness and shyness. Okay, we're going to see. Okay, humility 
is the median between a pride and lowliness. Modesty is the median between, um, wow, this word, ostentatiousness and uh, ignobility. Mm -hmm. Self uh, count, uh, self content is the median between greed and indulgence. Patience is the median between anger and intensity. Reservation is the median between in, uh, impungent, impundence and uh, reticence. Wow, what a word. Uh, similar concept apply uh, with regard to other emotional traits. The names uh, that we have used uh, for these traits are not significant. What is important is for the concept as a whole to be understood. So let me see if we're going to if we're going to go in these traits one by one or not. Just one second, quickly, quickly. Okay, I think we're going to go to all of this. Uh, okay, so let, let's do uh, quickly, and we're going to explain uh, at least uh, some of them. Uh, on on one hand, they are obvious. On the other hand, they are not so obvious. So it's a similar generosity is a median between stinginess and uh, uh, profligacy. Um, so stinginess is not good, right? When a person does not want to spend even on uh, on his family or on himself or anything, and profligacy also not good. That, that uh, person like uh, anybody like ask him for money or he the person is show off and he spends all of this money. Also not good, but generosity meaning that you you live whatever you need for your family for yourself, right? Uh, and then and then you you give to others. Yeah, that's that's the proper way. Like, uh, uh, and if a person would spend all of, all of his money, right, uh, very fast, so he would put himself in a situation when community now has to would would have to uh, um, support him, right? Which is not good. Okay, so assurance is the median between rashness and timidity. Uh, so he's also like some some people like they they have to respond quickly like now like, or some sometimes you you don't re respond somebody in a two hours five hours ten hours so a person like uh, will send you a question mark like how come you you there you are normal what are you sleeping what is like right so rashness uh, and is uh, rashness in decisions also. So some people like, like have to make decisions right away, right? And uh, some people never make decisions in their life, and they suffer, and they and they proud of it, and uh, things somehow like get resolved, not not in uh, what, what the way they want, but uh, because they never do do anything, right? So that's so you have to be in the middle. You have to contemplate. You have to get advice and uh, get to something. So next one, uh, good uh, natureness is the median between aggressiveness and shyness. Um, okay, so sh um, aggressiveness, of, of course, uh, today is like very, very, uh, it's like uh, this, uh, the, the states of ag aggressiveness, like, um, like many people like found that it's, it's like very commendable. And, and I see on uh, our channel how like some people like, like, uh, like uh, live such a, aggressive like messages like draw all of the conclusions so i uh, one, one one person left uh, left such a message on a uh, commentary on on one of our videos so i reply and it looks like i i hope that that he deleted the message i mean the, the person got embarrassed like uh, i mean i just explained like uh, that there is was no no reason to to to, to be such a like uh, aggressive like and so disgusting and shyness also not good but like when one person is shy so he he or she always quiet and nobody knows what's going on some people some sometimes people can step on this person and they would not even know right so also not good right um uh, so you have to be in the middle right not too aggressive not too shy somewhere in the middle so it, it depends on situation humility is the median between pride and lowliness so prideful person is uh, Hashem said if he's in the room or she's in the room I don't want to be there. There's uh, there's no room. 
It's 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 uh, this uh, this person pride uh, taking all of the room. I, I have to get out. That's what Hashem said, right? And uh, it says in Perkyov that even the family of that person hates him, right? Even though he's uh, the father of the house, yeah, everybody hates him because of the pride. Loneliness also, like I know, I know these people. Some people they always complain, always, always negativity. Always, I cannot do this. I not, I'm not good for anything. So. I mean, some sometimes it it comes from from the childhood that uh, that uh, these crazy parents I don't know what, what they want to wanted to do is uh, from like make, make from this little child uh, from this little boy they want to make him soldier he was three years old I don't know like crazy so some people in the have this character right loneliness All, also not good right but um, but humility is good humility you you know what, what you are what you're capable of. Right? You can be talented, very talented, but you, 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 you humble. If they ask you, you answer. If you don't, don't ask you, keep quiet. Modesty is immediate between... Um, I cannot read this word. Astenationness and ignobility. So also, like you, you don't have to be like uh, all, all the way out, like, uh, uh, like uh, to, to, to one extreme to another. Okay. I guess uh, patience, uh, patience uh, and anger, right? So it's understandable. Have to be somewhere in the middle. Uh, okay, so we believe it. Uh, I think he's going to explain some other traits here as examples. Okay.